The company plans to idle its number three paper machine, reducing production by about 200,000 tons. The reduction, according to Verso, is a matter of supply and demand, but the news is deja vu for the people who live here. We had hoped that we wouldn't be here again so soon. It's going to be devastating. All we have left is the mill. The layoffs come almost exactly one year from the last round of 300. And each time a community built on manufacturing loses a little bit of itself. When I was young, you come out of high school, you had the foundry to go to, you had the shoe shops, you had all kinds of places where you could work. That's it now. Jay's town manager worries about the families who will be affected by the layoffs, also affected the logging industry. And these towns continue to look for ways to bring in new business and new jobs to balance out an industry with so much uncertainty. It's a difficult thing to try to pull people into an area that you've got your major taxpayer, your major employer that keeps downsizing. Verso will watch the market and then decide if they plan to put that number three paper machine back into service. If not, those 190 jobs will be permanently eliminated. In Jay, I'm Katie Thompson, WMTW News 8.